somebody tried to stir up something with me and you uh, <laughs> on uh, social media, saying Mick Foley's claiming that Steve Austin's working punches were no day at the beach, and I'm like <laughs> picturing you reading that and nodding your head and be like, "Damn right they weren't," you know. <laughs> like if somebody would say, "Like, why didn't you say anything?" I'd be like. He was Steve Austin, and and I'm not, and Steve. I mean, it's been years. I don't, you know, I I'm not above it, but I swear I'm not pandering to you. When people will ask me, you know, what was the the favorite character, or favorite time in wrestling, you know, like there's different answers in different days. Oh yeah. But there were times when when you were Stone Cold, I was Mankind, where everything we did just it was so much bigger. The responses were so much bigger than anything I'd ever you know, like visualized wrestling could be. And it was just, uh, man, it was really, you know, it was, it was really a pleasure to be out there. But with that being said, yeah, when uh, you got that comeback, it was no day at the beach. <laughs> before, before I continue my story and my point about Leon, okay, and we love to call him Leon, uh, before we get back to Vader, uh, I question, were my working punches that stiff? For you. They were- Okay. Um, I want 100% honesty. All right. Not as stiff as, as Vader's, um, because yours tended to, to pick up velocity during the comeback. Um, you believed, which was part of what made yeah. it. And the more you believed, the, the more they hurt. Uh, <laughs> Le- everything Leon did hurt, yeah. you know. And uh, yours were, were tended to, to pick up momentum during the uh during the comeback, they were harder than Brett's rubber mallets. Uh, Shawn, Shawn Michaels, uh, you know, he he was a hard hitter. I think he had to because of his. Well, the thing about Shawn was he, he had a pinpoint accuracy, so his kind of stung just because, like, you weren't thinking that this this dude that weighed about two fifteen twenty was going to be snapping those things, and you know, you sold them, but yeah, they they peppered you a little bit. <laughs> Listen, you, I think I've mentioned this to you, and I don't, and, uh, and I love your show because you know you, you you treat the business with such respect, but you talk pretty openly, you know. And I was watching, I can't remember was watching, I had to have been watching Rock because I think, uh, or or you, right? Yeah, it was, it was you were you were you were you were still active. You were active for about a year after I, or a couple of years after I retired the first time. And I just kind of leaned over to Triple H, and I went, Hunter, uh, you've, you've worked with both Austin and Rock, right? <laughs> he goes, yeah. <laughs> What's the major difference? And without thinking about it, he goes, uh, Rock's uh, punches didn't hurt at all, and Steve's hurt like hell. And I went, bingo. <laughs> <laughs> 